Laura Ingram is a well-known conservative television and radio host. She gained prominence as the host of The Laura Ingram Show. Later, she hosted the popular Fox News show The Ingram Angle. Throughout her career, she's been known for her strong and often polarizing opinions on various topics. In this video, we'll dig deep into the personal life of Laura Ingram, focusing on why she never chose to marry. Facts First presents Laura Ingram has never married, now she reveals the reason why. Laura Ingram's Formidable Career Laura has had a significant and diverse career spanning various fields, including law, writing, and media. Born June 19, 1963, she first stepped into the limelight as a speechwriter in the Reagan administration during the late 80s. She followed this with a successful career in law, having earned her JD from University of Virginia in 1991. She served as a clerk to Supreme Court Justice Clarence Thomas and worked at the prestigious law firm Skadden Arps. Transitioning into the media industry in the mid-90s, Ingram became a notable figure in the conservative media landscape. She initiated her media journey, hosting her radio show, The Laura Ingram Show, and later took on the role of editor-in-chief at LifeSet, a conservative website she co-founded. Her media presence expanded as she became the host of The Ingram Angle on Fox News Channel in October 2017. She's been known for her steadfast support of Donald Trump, even serving as an informal advisor during his presidency. Her education background laid a solid foundation for her prolific career. She graduated with a Bachelor of Arts from Dartmouth College in 1985, where she studied English literature and Russian. Throughout her career, she's also been an author, penning several books that have made it to the New York Times bestseller list. A Mosaic of Relationships Laura Ingram's love life has been a source of public interest over the years, marked by connections with several prominent figures. Her romantic journey began during her time at Dartmouth, where she forged a significant relationship with fellow student Dinesh D'Souza. Originally an exchange student from India, D'Souza and Ingram's friendship blossomed amidst the chaotic college life. Their bond was so strong they eventually became engaged, though ultimately marriage was not in the cards for them. Despite this, their friendship endured, grounded on mutual respect and intellectual rapport. D'Souza played a critical role in shaping Ingram's approach to journalism and politics, encouraging her to remain steadfast in her principles. As her career soared in the 90s, her love life began to garner more public attention. A significant chapter during this period was her relationship with Keith Olbermann, a political pundit known for holding views polar opposite to hers. Interestingly, their political differences were not the cause of their breakup. Olbermann noted they were personal impediments that prevented the relationship from progressing further. This relationship later seemed to turn sour, with public disagreements between the two being aired in the media. Towards the turn of the millennium, Ingram was linked with several other notable figures, such as Democratic Senator Robert Torricelli in 1999 and allegedly with economist Lawrence H. Summers in the early 2000s. Triumph over Adversity 2005 was a pivotal year in Laura's life for various reasons. Not only was it a time marked by romantic engagements, but also when she faced one of her toughest personal challenges, a diagnosis of an aggressive form of breast cancer. This diagnosis came just as she was preparing to embark on a new chapter with entrepreneur James V. Reyes, to whom she was engaged. The sudden diagnosis was a jarring pause in her life narrative, bringing an end to her engagement with Reyes. Despite the gravity of her health crisis, Ingram exhibited extraordinary resilience. She was determined to face the illness with grit and perseverance. Undergoing surgery and chemotherapy, she embarked on a battle that tested her strength. Throughout this period, she maintained a positive outlook, treating her treatment journey akin to training for a marathon or crafting a meticulous legal document. In a 2013 interview, she recounted this period as a time of personal triumph, demonstrating that her will and spirit remained unbroken. Her story serves as an inspiring narrative of hope and resilience, showcasing the indomitable human spirit. A Blossoming Family While her professional journey and personal relationships have been at the forefront, another vital aspect of Laura Ingram's life is her role as a mother. Embodying her advocacy for adoption, Ingram took the significant step of adopting her first daughter, Maria, from Guatemala 12 years ago. 
This event marked the blossoming of Ingram's family, a testament to her commitment to providing love and nurturing to children in need. Her family continued to grow with the addition of two more children, Dmitri and Nikolai, whom she adopted from Russia. Together, they have formed a loving and cohesive family unit residing happily in Washington, D.C. This chapter of her life highlights her dedication to nurturing a family grounded in love and unity, showcasing a softer, maternal facet of the usually assertive public figure. A Life Unbound Throughout her life, Ingram has chosen not to marry, a decision that has sparked public curiosity. While the reasons remain private, it appears this choice has allowed her to focus wholly on her blossoming career and her role as a mother. Ingram's decision can be seen as a reflection of modern societal shifts where marriage is not seen as a compulsory life path. Choosing to remain unmarried has possibly given her the freedom to carve out a life that resonates with her individual beliefs and values. Her unwavering focus on her career and commitment to her children showcase a woman who has built a fulfilling life on her terms, breaking away from traditional societal expectations to create a path defined by personal fulfillment and success. Throughout her life's journey, Laura has displayed a blend of strength and commitment, both in her professional pursuits and in her personal life. Her experiences, spanning from navigating complex romantic relationships to embracing motherhood wholeheartedly, paint a picture of a woman of strength and determination, unafraid to forge her path in a world often defined by conventional norms. Ingram's Hot Takes Let's take a moment to look back at some of the controversies and scandals she's found herself caught up in. During her time at Dartmouth, Ingram spearheaded some contentious initiatives that attracted significant backlash. In the 80s, she made headlines for revealing the names of students attending a Gay Students Association meeting, a move she defended as a freedom of the press issue. But years later, she publicly changed her stance on homosexuality, partially influenced by the experiences of her gay brother, Curtis. Despite this, she maintains that a marriage should only be between a man and a woman. Moving to her stance on immigration and race, She's been a persistent critic of immigration, often voicing strong opposition to reforms and policies aimed at easing immigration laws. She also has controversial opinions on racial issues, sometimes attracting accusations of fostering white nationalist rhetoric. This includes her criticism of demographic changes in the U.S., which has been perceived as a nod to white nationalist talking points. And she's faced backlash for different responses to black and white athletes speaking out on political issues, and her defense of the Trump administration's divisive zero-tolerance family separation policy. Now it's time to hear from you. What are your thoughts on the fact that Laura Ingram has never been married? Let us know in the comments section below.